okay part three I hope part three I've done done some but okay we're walking down my walkways all right and let's see let's pick up a rock bam this is what I'm talking about you see the bear head looking to the left he's even got teeth he come to this side tilt it just a little bit bam this in focus Indian face this is a totem effigy rock any which way you turn this rock you make your own mind up now it's like a, a Indian with a wolf head on his head see the wolf head on top or the bear head and over the Indian's face the Indians the Indian's face is in there see his two eyes bear bear head on top or the bear eating a man that's probably what this totem is about probably when a, a legend of a bear eating a man anyway you could turn these rocks and you'll be surprised what you get out of it way and what we got here birds on the nest there's two birds she's on her nest down here bird on the nest indian tail bird on the nest baby in the belly hard-headed old lady you get to know these things you get to know what to anyway check up on it if you're interested if this is cool, you'll be surprised on what you find. I uh, found this. Check this one out. We're going we're gonna to slide in. Bam. Right here's your eye, your beak, one wing, two wings, your tail feathers. It's a bird. And it's made out of some kind of jasper, some kind of, uh, maybe some kind of silicate. Uh, it's very colorful. Uh, that's what I'm talking about. I'm talking about totem effigies as such bird stone but you could turn it and you can make other things out anyway they didn't have cell phones they had these guys this is what it is this is how man evolved this is a past civilization that goes back way i'm talking about pre-flood people taught the indians taught them how to do it taught them how to how to what medicines to use what uh how to live but anyway here, here's my totem effigies here you go some more This is how we got it set up. And all my rocks, I can walk down my sidewalk any, anytime I want to and pick up a rock and there's something up with it. It could either be a fossil, mineral, rock, stone. It's something. All my rocks are something. I collect it for over two years almost every day. This is what I do. Look at this old guy. Notice the black would be the black ponytail of an Indian. He's like a Mohawked Indian. He's on top. We can we can ride up a little bit closer so y'all can make it out. Okay, the black on it is his hair. You can see his eye, his nose, his mouth. A perfect Indian face right there, guys. I'm gonna try to put it dead in the middle of the screen. Bam. The black would be his hair, and that's like uh, slag. We call slag. This is another rock that's been worked. I'm about to take this one to UT and have it test and see how old it is. But this is how they worked it. Damn if it don't look like a little spaceship flying up in the air right there going to the moon. Look at that. Now that's crazy. I don't know. Look at it as we walk around. But as as you walk, as, as you can focus, every bit of that sanding, every bit of this has been tooled to cast shadows. Okay, 